Well, let's talk about the intercultural design process. Um, we would like to start with that. Uh, in our situation between La Bestiale and Studio Pies, um, uh, we saw that um, uh, there's a differ difference in uh, the way of thinking and the way how to start with the project. And as you probably understand, this is the porcelain version, and this is on the open stand. And when you flip it, it's gonna close the open side, and this side on the bottom is also closed. So uh, this creates a complete different change in atmosphere, especially when the, the room is, is dark in the evening. So I think everybody will understand that it changes a lot when you flip the lamp. And in Luis's version, there's gonna be a whisper on the bottom of this side. For this research, we use the, um, the methodology of morphology. So our question was, we asked ourselves, how can we create interesting objects with distant fabrication techniques using a body geography and a study? <laughs> this is David with these camps. This is me. Uh, what we did then is uh, to, to find and uh, cut shapes out of our, uh, out of our bodies actually and experimenting with the texture also. They found the uh, uh, printing material that has also the translucent uh, um, quality. And, and there we started printing the first cups. Yeah, it looks really nice. Ah. <laughs> uh, so I think we achieved a good product and a good idea. And the idea is that um, there are batteries inside, but they get charged by the movement. There's a little battery that goes around the donut coil, um, and that creates electromagnetic waves, and um, that charges the battery.